So, in the summer, Renee becomes Fifty Shades of Sexy. Um, I'm getting pretty tan right now. <laughs> Um, I can always tell when I'm getting pretty dark because where I live, I get certain scowls from certain people, but that's their problem, not mine. Um, they're jealous. Uh, it's usually the same one or two people, but I figure there's some spiritual message in there somewhere and nothing happens without my spiritual karmic consent. So, um, I'll have to figure out what that's about. What is this? This is Renee's crazy before work video when her brain finally comes online uh, <laughs> after a shitty night's sleep and um, overcompensating this morning with a little bit too much caffeine. Why did... I was about to say, it's pretty windy out there. The satellite just shut off. You know, the world's coming to an end. Can't get the satellite. Um, anyway, yeah, this is like my hurry up and Gary for work because I have to ride my bike to work, which is like two and a half miles away, but my <laughs> fat ass takes about 15 minutes to get to work because it's, from where I am, it's all uphill. So it takes about 15, 20 minutes. Today I'm probably going to take my time because I'm really only going to be there <laughs> from three to seven and then I'm going for my training bike ride after work. Let's cross our fingers Renee doesn't end up in the ER today like I almost did last week because I went, um, it was really hot and humid weather and I was in a negative mind state, pissed off at the world. Um, one of those things, you know, those things where, you know, what you think about, you bring about. Uh, I'm feeling a little better today. I know that I probably should come straight home on my bicycle and study for my boards, but you know what I say. Of course, I put, I do that, and I'll, you know, I'll regret doing that. But I got to get this training right in, man. I am doing this trail run. Whatever possessed me to do it, it it's like, I don't know. I figure I had to get back into the racing game somehow. And I did this trail run before, it's 20 miles, and I mean, I have about a month lead time prep, but as long as I can walk, I can finish it. There's no time limit, it's very casual, in laid back environment, it took me seven hours to finish it, walking and jogging and stuff, so, you know, it's in the forest, so you kind of lose all track of time, so there is a spiritual dimension to it, to get some spiritual insight, think of book ideas, think of, I have a lot of things to think about while I walk. So I will not be bored and probably will not have my phone on because what for? You're in nature. You know, the forest will pull me in and I'll be just fine. So I'm celebrating this 4th of July with my right to ride. I'm free no matter what people tell me, no matter what's going on around me, no matter what people think of me or whatever. Uh, other people's opinions about me are not my problem. And, you know, no one's freedom can be taken away from them without their consent anyway. So if uh, usually these days I encounter a negative situation, I start looking within. Not in like a negative, like self-deprecating way. But I, use, I find that the roots of problems usually have some spiritual dimension. So, okay. What I have on my face, I have a mixture of some cleansing uh, stuff. I have it's Shea Moisture products. I love Shea Moisture products. I love um, the message that he's putting out. Um, very multicultural, multiracial. I'm all for the campaign and all this other stuff. I love it. I, I mean, I, I just, I love the backstory, the family story about Shea Moisture and, you know, um, just using very down home products. Okay. All right. This is enough talking because I got to go get ready any longer and I will not be able to take a shower and, you know, 
Mm. You know, women in summertime, excoriation in the foals. That's all I'm saying. Bye. <laughs>